All right, pizza review time. We're at Russo's in New Hope, uh, New Jersey. The town's fucking beautiful, Austin. It's like every little kid is coming down Main Street. They got the stores. Feels like Thanksgiving. They got a bunch of Italian flags that all want the uh, Irish. But yeah, just very picturesque, very New Englandy. Even though we're in Jersey, uh, cool vibes. The guy in there, he's calling me cuz. He's like, "How's life out there? Like you're just doing it out there?" Huh? I'm like, "What do you mean, just everywhere?" He's like, "Yeah, how is it out there?" That's what he asked. How is it out there? He's like, "Just everywhere. It's great." They did really good for us. Thank you. That was really. Something, you mean that, just out something there? that we needed, cuz. Yeah. You just need out you know? there like life. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's good. I mean, you brought notoriety back to small business, mom I and pop. appreciate Pop. that. He's super nice, guys. Like, come, I'll make you dinner off menu. The pizza, he's giving the story. It's fucking huge. You can't even get through the door with it. 30 bucks. He's like, you know, McDonald's, he's right. They raised the price because Gavin Newsom, who's a piece of garbage on hate small business, but they, they're, fast food, 60 bucks because they raise minimum wage. Good, but then the McDonald's jacked it. I'm ranting. Point is, like, you come here, 40, 50 bucks, feed the whole family, no problem. He gave me cannoli, meatball. What's up with the size of these? It's family. Okay. You know, like the big bowl pasta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you go out to eat with two or three kids, you go to McDonald's now at sixty dollars. Yeah, right. So you come here, you get a you get a thirty dollar pie, you leave five bucks for a tip, have some sodas, and for 40, 50 bucks, you, you know, you can take the kids out. Love it. Cuz. I started calling him Cuz often by the end. I don't know if you caught that. I shot his like He's like, here you go. I was like, thanks, cuz. Nice to meet you. Thanks, thanks man. Yep. Super nice guy. And he's a stool. He watches Rough and Rowdy. He's like, I bet with you. Super nice guy. This pizza's gigantic. He said he's from Robbinsville area, tomato pie. He does a little less starch. You grew up in Trenton, Bristol. So I know you went out to Robbinsville. Yeah, yeah, they, that's a tomato pie land. But my, old, my problem with them always was it was a little too starchy sometimes. Yeah. So we all have the same. Ingredient and all, I just put back a little bit on mine. Okay. The one thing about doing pizza this big is how do you keep that crunch on that big of a slice? One bite, everyone knows rules. It was in the box. My shirt, he gave it that, it's dripping in. Yeah. Listen. I do like it. But. My only thing would be, I do think if you went a little smaller, you'd have a tighter, crispier pizza. It's really hard with this mega pizza to keep it from doing that flop. But it's good, the sauce is good, the bread is good, the crust is good, the town is phenomenal. I'm gonna go New Hope, of course it's called New Hope. Seven, five? Again, I think you just gotta, it's so hard to do a slice this big that keeps the crunch. Now let's do all the other assorted goodies. He didn't even say this was for, I don't even really love cannolis, but Cuz made me do it. Oh! Oh. Forgot the whole thing, I bought, I bought a t-shirt. This was the slogan. Hi. Hi there. You ever seen a slogan? When you're done, let us get a picture. Yeah, of course. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks, Cuz. Yeah. Thanks, Cuz. <laughs> <I'm> Russo. <laughs> Michael Jordan of Pizza. Unbelievable. That's a 10.9 t shirt. That's a review. I'm going to lie. Yes, this is cool. How was it? Very good. Right. Thanks, David. Yep. This guy, this That's my wife Jennifer, our son's in law. He graduated college. I'm Steve. Hi. I'm Russo. Okay. Minnesota? How long have you guys had this? I'm We're here four years at this, this one. We opened this one in 2019. You guys are like the nicest people in the world. Thanks. Very nice people. Well, yeah. yeah. She's a nurse and she stopped nursing 20 years ago. Well, nurse, our I'm always, yeah, the nicest people. She's too. That's my sweetheart. We've been married 25 years, David. Couple. I love it. Congratulations. Thank you. Hi. It's our sixth uh, restaurant. Oh, wow. We had full scale. We were in Seattle for 10 years. We well, ended, my brother that? was a fighter. He was a fighter, but he didn't have no money. You know, they were selling cheesesteaks in between. We were here, we had a kid on the way, and we were going to go to Wildwood and open up a spot. 
and he heard my mom told him, and, and he said, just come out here, give a shot. Yeah. So we took a look, but it's Seattle, brother. You know, when you're from Philly and you yeah, go to Seattle, yeah. it's like fucking... You're calling people cuz they don't know what you're doing. They don't know what you're saying. They think you're a blood. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. I'm not kidding. Yeah, I, right. I, I used the word. I said, cuz, what's up? He goes, what do you mean by that? My brother had to go, no, no, no. He, you know, he goes, Steve, you got to watch. There are gangbangers out here, and cuz means one of the signs. I don't know. Oh, oh, you meant, I thought you I went like, yo, cuz. I, I thought you, when you said blood, I thought you meant like they thought yeah, you Yeah, bloods and crypts. Yeah, yeah, I thought you meant cousin, joints. like cousin, like related. Right. That's what well, we I said. I know what you mean, but I thought they're like, wait, I'm not related to you. I thought they were taking it literally. You no, I wish, you, I'm like, I'm I wish you would have taken it that yeah, way instead of like, I'm going to get shot out yeah, front, no, man. You know, but we had a cheesesteak no. joint, and then, it, and then it morphed into the pies. Because yeah. we grew up, yeah. you know, doing pies and tiny yeah. food. Right, well, I love and it. And gambling. Yeah, well, that, you man after my own heart. Good to meet you guys. Yeah. Congratulations. Dave, it was really cool yeah. meeting you, man. Yeah. See you. Bye, hey, nice to meet you guys. Yeah, I will. All right. All right. Uh, that's like, every once in a while doing these, like the Uncle Jerry's, you just run into people who are like too nice for Earth. Those people are so nice. And you said it when you called. They're like, oh, he was just a happy guy when he placed the art. They're just happy fucking people and actually give you faith in like humanity.